Hi there, Sarah Dahlquist here with Doll Style, and I'm here today with ShopAdorn.com to talk about the Ms. Wood Leather Obi Belt, and this belt is so incredibly fantastic. The reason I love it is it works for almost every body type. Whether you're an hourglass, it's going to hug your curves, or you're a straight body, it's going to create some curve in your midsection, it's a fantastic belt. It's also crazy versatile. It goes, like if, let's say you had like a, a loose boyfriend cardigan, it would, you could wear it over the loose cardigan and it would actually like bring in the shape and create contour and shape and interest to, you know, that cardigan. Or whether it be a dress that has no shape, it just adds and creates a waist and definition in that midsection. And I always love to do that because it's really important, especially as a woman, to kind of show how tiny you are here. Okay, so here today we're going to be talking about how we're going to wrap this leather obi belt because there's just a few really great ways that we can do that. Okay, our first and our most basic way is to take the belt, take the shiny side of the belt, put it in front of you, lay it on the tiniest part of your waist, not too low, not too high, right there on the tiny of your waist, and then we're going to wrap it, we're gonna turn around here, we're gonna crisscross and wrap it in the back, and then bring it around the front, Change sides, wrap, again, crisscross again, wrap in the front. All keeping the shiny side on the outside. And then we're going to tie here in the back. And you want to tie it really tight because these leather belts will stretch out a little bit and you want to make sure that they're really snug in the body because they will kind of loosen up and stretch out a little bit. So that's the most basic way to wrap the obi belt. The shiny side of the leather is out. It gives about gives the waist some contour and some interest, and it's just it's it's super easy. Now another way that I like to wrap this belt is there is a really beautiful suede side to these belts that are a little bit softer and have some texture to them. So I like to show off that kind of contrast and texture. So we're gonna wrap just like we did around the waist. We're gonna crisscross in the back bring it around to the front, and then when I'm crisscrossing, I'm actually going to twist the leather obi belt so that the suede shows on the outside, or I mean on the, yeah, on the outside, and then we're gonna bring it back around again, crisscross again in the front, or in the back, bring it around to the front so you can see that the suede's already there, and then you can actually crisscross again so the shiny side is out. And the obi belt isn't one of those things where there's a right way to do it. You just need to kind of wrap it around, twist it, get it on your waist, and then get in front of a mirror and play with it. Move the straps around a little bit, make it right for your body type. But what I like about this is both the shiny side of the leather shows as well as the suede side, so it gives it a lot more dimension and texture. So this time we're gonna knot the belt and then wrap it around the body. So we've got it, you know, the basic wrapped around her body at the tiniest part of her waist, crisscrossed in the back, we're gonna bring it around to the front and then we're going to just knot it right over left, left over right, creating a square knot right there. And then we're gonna take the other loose strands and wrap it again around the body, crisscrossing in the back, around the front again, crisscrossing in the back. And you can either take the excess and bring it around and tuck it in the front. Here and around the front again. So that way you don't have a tie in the back and it's nice and flat in the back and then you have the knot in the front. And again, play with the little straps here. If you don't want the suede to show, then play with the straps and pull the shiny side of the leather out or you can twist it around and let that suede show a little bit. Okay, and for our last wrap, we're going to do the front tie. So again, we're wrapped around the tiniest part of our waist, crisscross in the back, bring it around to the front, and you can lay it flat or twist it. I kind of like to twist it, give it some dimension. I'm going to tie it in the back so it wants to be really nice and tight and not move. We're going to bring it around to the front again, and we're going to do just a side tie. And what I like to do is do a horizontal bow. So we just do a bow, but I pull the bow horizontally, and then that kind of allows this little drape here on the side, and then you've got the front tie. 
So we've talked about the Ms. Wood Obi Belt and how to wrap it in just a few of the most basic ways, but stay tuned because we're going to be talking about some more advanced, cool, interesting, funky ways to tie the belt as well.